Today we're going to show you a new version of a very popular product for your 2015 through 2019 Mustang Fastback from Stita. The Steeda jacking rail has been very popular with Mustang owners since they first came out for the 2015 Mustang. This is the newest version. Now this is going to be their ultra light low profile, but this is a full length version. This is actually going to be longer than the original ones and cover the entire pinch weld from front to back, making them much easier to use. Now begin the installation by getting underneath the car. Now this is actually an install you can't honestly do on the ground. Maybe you drive up on a curb, it's really not hard to get to. You want to grab the correct side. Now if you're doing this car, the passenger side one is going to be slightly shorter. The best way to make sure, just line up the holes. You see our front holes line up, that one and that one line up so we know we have the correct one. Now we're gonna remove these three factory bolts. All right, what we're gonna do now is get the jacking rail up into place. We're gonna use the provided hardware. What you wanna do get all the bolts just started before you tighten anything down. Now if you've watched my previous installation videos and we've done these before, sometimes I will remove this seam sealer right here. If it has really, really heavy that it allows you not to get this into place, best to scrape it off. Most times I've found though recently, you can leave it on, it's absolutely fine. Now these jacking rails have a really nice powder coated finish and Steeda goes even so far as to put caps on the front and back and then also includes caps for the holes. I repeat the process on the other side and your installation's finished. Now since they do call this a full length design, you might be wondering why it stops where it does. The reason is this mounting point here is used for Steeda's extremely popular subframe IRS chassis braces. So if you put that brace on, that will actually come to here, makes it almost a full length piece when they're installed. Now for the side profile here, you can see why they're called low profile. If you remember the original style ones, they actually stuck down below the pinch weld. These are even with it front to back. You really can't even see them. As you just saw, the Steeda Ultralight Low Profile Full Length Jacking Rails are very, very easy to install. Now the benefit here is if you're jacking the car up anywhere from the side, you don't have to worry about the pinch weld, put it right on the jacking rail and jack it up. I've actually found too, you can go in the middle and lift the whole side at one time, which will save you a lot of time if you're at the track. Now as far as installation goes, the only tools you'll need is a 15 millimeter socket and a ratchet. Figure about half an hour, we'll be back on the road in no time.